Okay, today we're looking at what I call superior purity. And we start with a song. Holy, 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 Lord God Almighty, all thy works shall praise thy name in heaven, sky, and sea. Holy, 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 merciful and mighty, God in three persons, blessed the Trinity. Marriage is critical. Uh, and I know people try to come up with all kinds of memes. I think I saw one recently that God did not get married. Even his son, while he was here on earth, did not get married. That there must, they must have a good reason for that. And that's because, of course, there are lots of challenges in marriage. You know, and some people believe that they can actually attain a state of perfection or superior spirituality by, you know, uh, being celibate. You know, so they come up with the earlier than thou attitude, and this is what is actually causing a lot of problems, particularly in organized religion, where you have people abusing, you know, uh, children, horrible behavior, sleeping with other people's, you know, wives, you know, engaging in all kinds of, you know, um, sexual relationship. Uh, that is not intended because they feel that they, are, they have superior purity. But let's go to scripture, Hebrews 13 verse 4, marriage is honorable among all. So the writer of Hebrews is emphasizing this, you know, uh, that you are you said not to get married doesn't make you spiritually superior to anybody else. It's honorable among all. God intends for people to get married and stay married because there are so many benefits that comes from the married state, you know, uh, even being able to manage your home and your congregation, uh, you know, and all of that. <clears throat> so it is a honorable thing to get married. If you're that kind of person that is contemplating, you know, I want to attain a state of perfection, I want to be more spiritual, so I want to avoid marriage, perish the thought, you know, go back to the counsel of scripture, according to, you know, the writer of Hebrews, inspired by God, marriage is honorable, you know, stay in your home, stay in your marriage. 